just days after the Iowa caucus, Elizabeth Warren is back in the Granite State. We're in the top three in Iowa, and now we've landed in New Hampshire, and we're out here fighting for every vote in New Hampshire. During her campaign stop at Nashua Community College, Warren took several questions from voters. Kimberly, I've met you several times. You're the one for me. Okay. Many of the questions were about health care and the rising cost of prescription drugs. I'm going to lower the cost of insulin, of EpiPens, of HIV AIDS drugs, and a whole set of other drugs that are commonly used. Warren's visit to the Granite State came just hours before she headed to Washington for the Senate impeachment vote. The Republicans have, in the Senate have locked arms around this president. And they established, when they put on a sham trial, that their first loyalty is not to the Constitution, but to Donald Trump. Once Senator Warren returns from Washington, D.C., after the impeachment vote, she plans to make several campaign stops across the Granite State ahead of the New Hampshire primary. An opportunity she is embracing to get her message out. I'm running on an anti-corruption plan that every Democrat can embrace and a lot of Republicans and independents as well. A two cent wealth tax that gives us opportunities for all of our kids and expanding social security. A grassroots campaign Warren says she is proud of. The money that comes in is $20 contributions to ElizabethWarren.com, uh, $5 contributions. Got a contribution recently for $2 from someone who said that they were unemployed but that they wanted to be part of the fight too. In Nashua, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.